where it's like they're just rare enough to where like you probably know like a level two adaption, but like once you start doing like level three, level four, however you want to put it, you know, it's uh, it can be really scary. And Shattuck definitely just plays that a lot too. So and speaking of Bylo, we got some we got some top tiers. Yeah, against some low tiers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, so uh, we got Thorn coming out from Corpus Christi. Is that where Thorn was? I think I believe so. So we've all heard the rumors of Thorn. <laughs> yeah. Oh god. Me and Clinroar. <laughs> Ego uh, Thorn. I can't believe that he's tagged. <laughs> hey, he's sponsored by Ego. Is that like a legit thing or is I it just something that he put? Oh my god. But dude, Incineroar's scary. I don't know. Especially Sky J. I was watching him play um, against like Nairn's the best Ridley. Ooh, and... That would be cool. Yo. Oh, that was cool. Oh, it doesn't get the camp, unfortunately. The X are looking super slick. Oh, oh that happened. Yeah. Was well, that that's what it's your forward tilt? What was it? F tilt? Wow. No, Incineroar's F tilt. <laughs> Dude, oh my god, they're just trading sweet spots. Let's go. Incineroar's F tilt feels so yeah. And the angle's disgust. Yeah, that, that is uh that was really Okay, that's one thing I do know that like you gotta be aware of is like a lot of Incineroar are gonna do that in a scramble situation. Frame five invincible Ash. Oh option. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and Byleth is just continually falling as we look at the players. <laughs> so the stream freeze. Okay, we're yeah, back. Yeah, definitely freeze, but Byleth took like eighty percent of the stream freeze and died. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, two one. Jeez, man. And Thorn Thorn is the villain here, but it's Byleth. And Byleth too. I mean, definitely coming out of like I mean, with Leo. Playing was definitely like a really cool character. You know, it's funny because when she came out, no one thought anything of it. Yeah, I thought she was on the like mid-tier. Like, eh, okay, she's not great, but yeah. But now it's like everybody thinks she's top tier. I don't think she's still top tier, but I mean, she's definitely good. I mean, she controls space like crazy. And I mean, you even get hit. Look at the way that DX is just controlling space right now. Oh, I did. Okay. Good luck. Okay. Go slap him. Put on this. He didn't pick up on my pun, but it was funny. And uh, Thorn with the two stock on the XRU. With the purple Incineroar, sadly, not the Cheeto one, which is the better one. But it's okay. The winner of this plays Sinister. <clears throat> And yet, you know, it, it's funny because Incineroar speed's not that big a detriment in this matchup just because Violet is slow as well. I mean, definitely the way to beat Incineroar is to take advantage of his speed. Well, it's another pretty slow character. This, this probably isn't a terrible matchup for uh, Incineroar. If it's losing, it's it's slightly losing. I don't think I don't think it'd be too bad. But we got Battlefield, and this could be a double edged sword or DXRU. I imagine Thorn can combo. Uh, DX are you just as well as he can combo him? And yeah, um, in case y'all don't know, Incineroar's uh, counter did get buffed. It is, you have to kind of read it. It's kind of, it, it's harder to react to, for sure. And we see DX are you trying to take advantage of the smash attacks, but I don't think that's what you want to do this early on in the stock. You're not going to kill with it yet. Wow, I'm surprised that Sybe didn't hit Guess the neutral be taking advantage of maybe some inexperience on TXRU's part. Eftil actually catching the roll surprisingly. Oh, that could be bad. Down air up smash not gonna kill. He's gonna put Thorn at a pretty bad percent though. Side B gonna put TXRU off stage. Off to side B back and gets neutral B for his troubles, but still hangs on to his stock. Your wolf looking very heavy right about now. Uppy. I think Thorn has a jump read or a new like his uh Incineroar short hop nair does cover neutral get up and jump. So I feel like that's why Thorn's throwing it out, because DXR is kinda doing those same two options. Spot dot side gonna take it. DXR you got a little scared there. Which is understandable, right? Because Incineroar's box options are just so good. Gonna make this back. Ops to beefy up B going right over the down smash. And yet, it, Wolf doesn't have the greatest of options. I don't think Incineroar is very easy to edge the Wolf. And I don't think the down smash is super applicable. It could be. Up smash going to take it. Thorn getting a little greedy with the counter. He did that the other time, too. But I think the XRU kind of just threw out that up smash. But we do have an even stock right now. But a counter 
Gonna put the XR unit back to 58% off stage. Does not get hit by the down tilt this time. Uh, Thorn yet to land one. I know that. I know that beats uh, Wolf's Up beat. Or two frames it. So we'll see if he gets one. Another nair. Trying to punish the normal get up. I mean, normal nair is just a good, a good way to cover ledge off. All right, no, no normal get up this time. Thorn looking for uh, F tilt. He's gonna take a lot of percent for his trouble. Dash attack, not quite yet. DXRU does need to hold on to this stock. There is rage. You want to take out the Incineroar before you lose your stock. Grab will kill, side B will kill. That's gonna do it. DXRU kind of getting hot, getting hot tomahawk shielding. I think that's what Thorn is reading. A lot of pressure from DXRU right now. Finally does get it back here. And a missed tech from Thorn. Gonna even the stock count right back up. 1-1. One, one on the board, and looking like this bull pick is working. Maybe the XRU mains will. Okay, you want to parry and store his neutral B. You can definitely punish it on a parry. <clears throat> oh, and DXRU getting a little baited by the counter. I think they baited, I think they buffed the duration of it as well. I don't remember. Another greedy counter from Thorn. No punish yet, and again, and a, and a greedy up smash from DXR. You're gonna get instantly neutral beat by the by a thorn. DXR, you does need to take the stock to win this to to stay in winners though. Less pressure for thorn here. Side so B gonna even this game pretty much right back up. And yeah, you have to be very careful to get into more shield. And Sora has really good out of shield options, so you have to be careful. And again, makes it back. No normal get up, which is probably what thorn was looking for. Up B is gonna make it back, and a instant side B. Maybe noticing the XRU shielding. A ten situation. Last hit. No forward smash, but that side B should take it. And yes, Thorn takes it 2-0 over DXRU, advancing to play Sinister in one of round three. And we have.